hope that you are doing well. My name is Selim Shaimi and in this video we will see what is artificial intelligence. Let's get into it. Honestly, the first time I learned about AI, I was just thinking about all Hollywood movies and it's probably your case, like you might think of Terminator or some robot that wants to take over the world. But in fact, AI has nothing to do with that. And at the risk of oversimplifying, you can consider AI as a lot of hidden algorithms that make the user experience greater. For example, Amazon is predicting the products that you might want to buy thanks to an AI system. So what is AI? Artificial intelligence is a branch of computer science that aims to create intelligent machines, and it has become an essential part of the technology industry. Given that everybody is talking about AI now, you would think that it's new, but the underlying techniques are not new, and the field started in the mid 20th century. And at this time, the first definition of AI was that every aspect of learning or any other feature of intelligence can in principle be so precisely described that a machine can be made to simulate it. Nowadays, research that is associated with AI is very technical and very specialized, and you have a lot of different options. And you know, there are big problems in AI that we didn't solve yet, such as reasoning, problem solving, perception, and learning. So initiating common sense, reasoning and problem solving power in machines is really difficult. In one hand you have machine perception, it deals with the capability to use sensory inputs to make sense of the world around it, but computer vision analyzes visual input with sub-problems such as facial, object and gesture recognition. Learning. So learning is a big one, and machine learning is a big part of AI. You have two kinds of learning, you have learning without supervision, that is very hard, and you have learning with supervision. So learning without supervision requires an ability to make sense of a vast amount of data. But learning with supervision, so with human help, involves more classification, for example. By the way, if you want to learn more about the differences between AI and machine learning, I did an entire video about this and I will put a link so that you can check it. Another problem that I didn't mention is the ability to manipulate and move objects. Ok, robotics is also a major field related to AI, because robots require intelligence to handle tasks such as object manipulation and navigation. Now that we have some intuition about AI, we will talk more about the history of AI in the next episode and how you are using it every day in the next one, so make sure that you are subscribed to my channel so you don't miss these episodes. Thank you so much for watching guys, as always I'm here to help so you can hit me up on any of my social media below in the description, and if you want to learn more about AI, you can watch my other videos and visit my blog selimshaimi.com where I'm posting articles about it.